Hello everyone. I wanted to show you one of my recent do-it-yourself project. It's actually a four-time DS8 clone made by Mark Barrell, and that's the time to thank him for all the help on the electronics, PCBs, etc. Basically, I'm going to take you briefly through the model. We got four-time DS8 clone, which is actually a DS7 with a small added noise of white and pink. On the top of this box I built another small digital uh, delay uh, that takes us between 80 to 200 milliseconds which can create a kind of cool breaks. So let's hear it. I'm gonna first trigger it from a piazza cell which I got it here on channel number 3 and let's hear it. As you can hear, a very long decay and a very long noise. That will be the sweep. Now I'm going to show you the LFO. I'm going to add some long decay and some LFO, which can get the wobble effect. Or if you go really really quick you can get a FM synthesized kind of thing. And of course the last thing, which is the white and the pink noise, which is the difference between the DS7, the original model, and the DS8. Here we got some white, pink, very nice for making kind of snares and heights, sounds. Okay, now I'm going to show you the machine working. These two channels, channel number 1 and 2, are connected to my DR110. It just sends trigger to channel no number 1 and 2. going to start with channel number 1, you can hear the kicks going in. I'm going to add the second channel, which will give us a kind of tom-tom sound. There is a very soft swip spot on the noise pan that you can really, really, really go wild if you catch it.
Okay, that's it guys. Thank you and I hope you enjoy. <laughs>